Good morning fellow felchers. Can you see the moon? I'm in my swag. I slept in here last night. There's my bedroom. Bedroom window, but uh yeah, set up the swag yesterday and uh yeah, here's me little goodies. Kept me going all night, eh? There's the bong along and the mole bowl. Let's have a look at the mole bowl. Oh, lovely, lovely. The herb. The electric spinach. That's good to see. And yeah, yeah. Bit of a slope here, though. But, uh, here's how much rubbish I made in one night. Look at the cigarette butts. Ooh, and I had a pizza for dinner in my swag. Look at me brew. Yeah, 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 so fucking. What's cracking, man? Private SA Norman 239655 slept in his fucking swag last night, man. Look all around me. <coughs> hey. Whoa. Wowzers. But, um. Yeah, sleeping in your swag outside's good because, um. There's a lot of, um. A lot of magnetism in the wires around your head in your in your bedroom. Um, yeah, from the electricity going through the copper coil, copper wire creates magnetism. So around your in your walls, all around your head and your bed, and that is electromagnetism basically. And I think it fucks with your head a bit and your sleeping patterns. Yeah, like if you turn the power off in a house, you find you relax. But uh, as soon as you turn the power back on, you, you amp up a bit more because you're surrounded by electricity in your house and magnetism being created by electricity travelling through the uh, copper wiring. So you're surrounded by electromagnetism. But uh, yeah, you hit the tit on your house at, at the um, electrical box. Uh, and then go back in the house, you'll feel that you relax. For some reason, all that electricity around you um, heightens your state of uh, alertness, or not really alertness, but just keeps you in a state of uh, constant fucking um, threats, or not threats, but a constant state of fucking something. Uh -huh. I asked Wendy, my mate, if she wanted to come over and sleep in the swag, but she was getting laid, so I really didn't want a, uh, didn't really want to know about that, so I said, you can sleep in me swag tomorrow night. So Wendy's coming over for a sleepover, and I don't think I've slept near a girl for 20 fucking years now, but, uh, there, should be fun. Should be fun in the sun. See the moon. See the moon man. The moon man. The moon man. Oh, it's the moon man. Hello, moon man. How are you? Hello, Sean. How are you? Did you sleep under the stars last night, mate? In your swag, hey, buddy? See, I've got my Harley shirt on. My Harley Davidson shirt that Shane gave me. And, um, today, Saturday. And, uh, back in the old days when I used to party on a bit, Saturdays was a gambling, horse racing day and beer drinking day with your buddies. That's what Saturdays were all about. And I haven't done that for a couple of years now. I think the last time I went for a horse racy put the races on was um, with Paul Norman. Yeah, they were good sat days. We'd get together every couple of sat days and uh, get our drinking money together and fucking throw a hundred on the table and take turns at betting on the horses and uh, get a kitty going with our wins and our losses. 
So fucking yeah, that's what sad day's all about. Bit of a boys day together drinking beer. 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 But um I'm lying here this morning thinking, fuck Norman, you've you've done a fair bit in your life, like you've been a soldier, you've been a husband and a father. Uh, you've been a radio DJ. Uh, now I'm in a second band called Emit. So a bit of a rock star as well. And, uh, yeah, I've done a lot. A lot of shit, man. But I'm 49 now and I've got a lot of plans up my sleeve. I need to make money from the songs on iTunes and Spotify. I'm hoping to get a couple of million hits, you know, or probably 10 million hits, hopefully, we can get. And then that'll pay for my, that'll pay the band and me. And then I'll be able to get my alchemy equipment, my furnace, my crucible, and all the metals that I want to melt. And uh, my ultimate goal is to open the dancing leprechaun. Uh, a nightclub in Nambucca with a um, recording studio in there. I'm going to have alchemy set up as well and have um, Thai food in there. And uh, then I'm going to invite bands from all around the world, U2, Sure, Ben Harper, um, 